hey guys, in this video we're going to be looking at a potential difference in a series circuit. So here is my series circuit. We can tell it is a series circuit because I can run my finger all the way around it. Now obviously you are going to draw your circuits with a pencil and a ruler. I've added a voltmeter to this and voltmeters have to be in parallel. They have to go across something. When we are looking at series circuits, we know that whatever the total voltage in the circuit is, has to be the voltage across the battery. So here across our bulb, we have a potential difference of three volts, which means across the cell, we must always also have three volts. Here we have a, a battery which has a potential difference of three volts across it. We have a bulb that has a potential difference of two volts across it. Now we know that this one and this one must add together to make this one up here, which means this bulb down here must have a potential difference of one volt across it. Here we have a cell that has a potential difference of 5 volts across it, a bulb that has a potential difference of 1 volt, a second bulb that has a potential difference of 1.5 volts. Now we know that all of these things here in the series circuit, the potential difference has to add up to equal the potential difference across the bulb. So we could do 5 volts, which is the potential difference across the um, bulb, minus 1 volt, minus 2.5 volts, which is going to equal 1.5 volts, which has to be the potential difference across that bulb there. They could also ask this as a wordy question. So assume we have two equal bulbs and a 6 volt battery. What is the potential difference across each bulb? So we know they have to be the same, so our 6 volt battery divided by two bulbs means they're each going to be three volt batteries. This video is part of a series on current potential difference and resistance in series and parallel circuits. Short videos explaining all the rules and then I'm going to do a big longer video combining all these rules, some really, really complicated questions for you to try and work them all out. So go watch the other short videos and then come back and watch the big video.